Hello everybody, welcome to week four of Blood Bowl Super League. We've got Group A action, Sol with Skaven versus Misspell Tree with Wood Elves. Misspell Tree has won the toss and elected to kick. Let's make them red and blue. And uh, this is unfortunately at Sol Stadium, so we have this uh, pitch to contend with, but never mind. Uh, Skaven with a stack and uh, some other things, and Wood Elves with extra money, and a Frenzy Dancer. Important to remember the Frenzy Dancer, of course, because uh, nobody would ever be bad enough to give away two free st serves to, what, to start the match. And in the booth is Dimmy G. Hello, Dimmy. Hello, Jimmy. Hello, everybody. Good evening, sports fans. Um, it was quite funny there, Jim. Your introduction, it sounded like you were trying to say 17 things at once and you kind of made an amalgamation of all of them. But, it was good, uh, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. It wasn't, yeah, yeah. It wasn't my best, uh, wasn't my best uh, introduction ever. The funny thing about yeah. this game is that uh, Dimmy and I have a vested interest in, in Sol winning. Yeah. <laughs> I'll flash up the, the league table there. I've, I beat Sol but lost a tree, so I kind of need, I need Sol to win because I've got the tiebreaker on the head-to-head -head versus him, right? So... I kind of need I kind of need Sol to be three, and uh, you know potentially Tree could win two games and go above Dimmy, so Dimmy also wants Tree to lose to Sol. So yeah, that's, that's where we're both at. We're both. I wouldn't say one, but I wouldn't be unhappy if that was the result. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> okay. 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 From a competitive standpoint, from a purely yeah. what is best for our win chances, that's what we want. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, I've not often heard uh, in the booth with me begin with an S before, Jimmy. That was quite impressive. And uh, sin the booth next. Yeah, it's in the booth with me tonight. It's Dimmy, you know. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Absolutely Dimmy. outrageous. Get together. Guess what, Jimmy? Guess what? It's what your thing? birthday soon. Is it? Yeah. When do you uh, think it is, Dimmy? <laughs> uh, I think it's Sunday. Yeah. Oh. Do you know why? Why, Dimmy? Do you know why? Because it's my birthday on Sunday, hey, hey. <laughs> and what we have the same chances? birthday. Yeah. Woo! Birthday Unbel brothers! <laughs> Unbelievable! It's gonna be twenty-nine again. Yeah. Yeah. For the I don't know for the eleventh time. No, hang on. I <laughs> it's not even eleven. Oh my god! I don't. No, it's the ninth time. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the fifteenth time for me. <laughs> yeah. Christ. Yeah, 29 again. Unbelievable. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> okay. Oh, high, high kick. This is pretty nice in the rain. I'd put a gutter under that. I wouldn't go for the thrower. Yeah, bludge. Bludge gutter. Wow. Well, yeah. The gutter wouldn't have caught it anyway. But yeah, this is the Dacker setup, right? Isn't he? He does this when he Dackers. Uh, it looks a bit like it could be. The problem is, like, you know. Well, L's are armor seven, so you can actually beat them up a little bit, can't you? So, um, oh yeah, well, let's see the, the three catches here for tree, or the cyan ones. You can tell them by the horns. Obviously, the woody's quite green. And, uh, no doubt, I'll instantly forget that later on and call them a lino. Yeah, yeah, it's it's really easy to do. Like they're not distinctive enough for me. But like that, that's kind of one of the things. It's kind of ine inevitable, right, with a video game representation. It's not as good as having. Oh, really push. clear players on tabletop, isn't it? You can have really super, super clear positions. I hate this from uh, Sol, by the way. Yeah, he's giving up a hit. Oh no, he's pushed away. This is fine. But I like the tree is just going to base both of those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tree on tree on your tackler, like what? Yeah, it's a bit, bit sad, isn't it? Really, more than a bit sad. It's a tragedy. He might be jet lagged. He's probably travelled like forty hours by yeah. camel to get to get to this game. <laughs> yes, of course. Uh, <laughs> this weekend gone. Um, there was. I mean, so like last weekend. And all. <laughs> um, it was, that was this weekend gone. I, I, I don't know what the. I can't speak. I'm sorry. I'm done. It was. It was Euro Bowl this weekend. Both Tree and Seoul participated. Uh, Seoul was represented in the USA, who actually came second. Which is not only unbelievable because it's USA in a European event, but it's also unbelievable because America. <laughs> and Sol. <laughs> Played football. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. So, and then Tree, Tree was in the European, I believe, with yes. uh, Hey Listen podcast, which is her and the girls from the podcast. Mm. Um, there is a Blood Bowl podcast uh, if any of you don't know about it check it out I'm sure it's called Hey Listen and it's from 
some of the Blood Bowl ladies. Yeah, Dizzy Bess, Cauliflower and Giraffe, isn't it? That's it, yeah, and Tree, of course. And tree, yes, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That was, has he picked the ball up? I can't see because has, you are not he rolling into it. He's, up, picked, yeah. he's picked the ball up, he's gone deep, he's got it on a thrower. I think the thing is with the thrower is obviously it's a 1D if you leap in if they're in a cage, right? Which is better than a 2D, but. Yeah, also, yeah, a strip, isn't it? The thing is, the strip, like, he's immune to strip, whereas. Oh, he's immune to strip, yeah, that's the mass. That's actually way more important. Because I was thinking, like, the problem is, is, like, the handoff is going to be a free plus because it's raining yeah so like normally you don't really care about handing off to gutter runners later on but like he's also he's automatically added a free plus failure state but like you say jim he can't be stripped by um strip ball because he has sure hands yep so probably outweighs the uh the carrying on the gutter for now yep Interesting that last turn Sol moved away from the Rat Argus so that it wouldn't bite anybody if it rolled a 1 to Blitz, which it did. And now he's put a Lime Rat next to it so that he's felt, you know, I No, guess. no, I think, I think that Lime Rat got blitzed next to it, didn't it, or something? No, 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 no. He, he literally, he literally left, that's why it's Bonehead. Oh, right? he moved it to him afterwards. So yeah, right. yeah, yeah, he moved yeah. it, he, he, he didn't have anything next to it so it wouldn't, it wouldn't, it wouldn't bite anybody. So that's that's a catcher on the left there, isn't it? So he's got an instant 3D with a rogue on a catcher. I quite, yeah. I quite like that. Yeah. And get away from the tree, come up the left hand side. I know it's early and stuff, but like honestly, like it's you just want to stay away from that stripper dancer, really. Well, the, I guess the frenzy one. Yeah, who do I get surfed? I mean, I personally, of course, would never get surfed. So. <laughs> I mean, like you say, like I think the rats just want to bang, right? Like, just let the rat, just they, let them bang, so let them they, bang. They do kind of want to bang, yeah. It yeah. Makes the dacker a bit weird. <laughs> yeah, probably. Soul's rat ogre is horrendous. I I'm using him tomorrow, Jim. Soul's rat ogre. Mmm. It's gonna be amazing. Can't wait. It's gonna be amazing, guys. Funny how hmm. Souls Rat Ogre was terrible in every single game, apart from when he played me for the best of 17 series and it cost three cars. <laughs> that is unbelievable, to be honest. I think it's Olivia has mostly been terrible. I, I, I guess like they've helped on one turns for, for Olivia and Soul, to be fair. But in general play, the Rat Ogre has been terrible for everybody. Here he goes oh, again, back to his player. Well done. Double ones. What happened there? Oh, he hasn't hit him yet. Oh, good hey -ho. Oh, what a, what a great oh. player Rattlegar is, eh? I love Rattlegar. Twelve on the isn't, armor. Isn't Animal Twelve Savagery a good skill? I mean... Oh, it doesn't get the power, so it's into two dice as well. What's the odds on a double skull here, Jimmy? <laughs> uh, oh, it doesn't even get the power there again. Oh, <laughs> my God. Now there's an assist. There's no support. Like, you can just punch this for free, right? Oh, puts the tackle in. So I guess we punch the tackle, blitz the roger. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, it's and then we just shepherd yeah. forwards. I don't even activate the tree here. I don't think. You've got to blitz the blitz the. Ta oh no, I guess you can. Yeah, you can. No, you can just tackle. punch, just punch the tackler. Put the yeah. assists in. Yeah, block the tackler first, then blitz the roger. Do you reckon it's worth? It's not worth fouling with eleven, is it? Surely, Jimmy, it's no. not worth fouling the especially, tackle. Especially not that roger. <laughs> I'm not talking about fouling the Rogar, I'm talking about fouling the tackle. Oh, I don't really tackle. care about the Rogar. Mm. A tree likes a foul. Tree does like a foul, but I don't know if she'll do it with 11. No, it's asking a lot, isn't it? It's a bit of a, yeah, it's a bit of a... What are we doing here? Gonna block the tackler first to give... Oh my the... god, she's gonna surf the Rogar. Oh no, she's not, okay. <laughs> I thought she was surfing the Roger then, <laughs> holy shit. But she can't because she moved it. Oh no, she hadn't moved the wrestle. She could have actually surfed the Roger. Yeah. Actually, yeah. It would have oh been God. a hell of a lot of dice to have. I mean, like, there's no there's no downside to it. Like, Soul's so deep in his half. Like, True, this yeah. is just a free surf. Like, honestly, I, I think I may well have been a complete moron and surfed <laughs> the Roger. Yeah. yeah, might have been the best player. It's really hard though, right, with their strength too. Um, yeah. 
And then, like, you're probably looking at, like, uphills with the dancer. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a bit silly. Uh, What's I it? mean... Oh, you can push, you can push. You've got the dancer there as well, yeah. Just definitely push and hit with the dancer. You've not moved the tree yet, you are. Oh, my God. <laughs> And get to hit it again with a catcher. No, he didn't need to re-roll it, Tree. Just re-rolled it. Why? He didn't need to re-roll it. Could the catcher could look, literally push it here. I, think, I, I think she wants to foul it. I think that's the only explanation. Foul she wants to foul it. Not dead. Oh, my God. <laughs> killed it. Oh, that, that, that's not good. Has Sol not got an apo? No. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, I love how shit. I love how completely shit right is right Ogre is. Oh my god. It delights yeah, this me. Is, that's huge. Mm. <clears throat> I don't want to say GG, but uh, you know. No, it's, uh, it's huge though. It's pretty big. <laughs> it's pretty big. It's, it's, it's a massive slide towards GG. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and unfortunately for unfortunately for us, <laughs> that is an equity shift. Wow, it's pretty funny. Pretty funny. I didn't realise Sol didn't even have an Apo, that's like even worse than I thought. Yeah, he's, he's got 13 players and 4 rerolls, yeah. I think I would have just took 3 rerolls and an Apo. But... Yeah. I think that's what Olivier, Olivier and... did. Well, Olivier has leader, doesn't he? He has like a leader for Yeah, sort of Sol, yeah, yeah, sort of Sol. So like, uh... Olivier's got 2 plus 1 and Sol's got 3 plus 1. Yeah, but yeah, Sol's just got a weird build, hasn't he? I mean, he did incredible with this build at mm. Eurobold, didn't he? I mean, having more rerolls is really good, so... Yeah, but having more players is also really good, Jim. Well, yeah. I mean, you know, Apple probably would have failed on that death anyway, so... <laughs> right, only works 37.5% of the time. KO's KOs are badly hurt, so it really. I, I wouldn't have apo. I'm not saying that I would have apoed it. I was just. I don't know. Maybe I would have because of the rogue, but it depends how much I feel that I need the one time. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> It really, it really does, it really does fill me with joy. <laughs> you, know, you know that, uh, the tidying up woman with what, what sparks joy? Well, rat ogres failing things <laughs> sparks joy for me. And them dying as well. The worst big guy in the game. Oh, brilliant. I'm using one tomorrow, can't wait. Excited? <laughs> well, sorry, Sol, well, but I sorry, Sol, sorry, Dimmy. I hope it dies. <laughs> well, I mean, like that's the thing. I've named it Sol's Roger, and it's dead now. So I don't know if I should <laughs> rename it. So. Oh, gee, if I had to base the front of this, I think I'd do it. Yeah, I think I would as well. I might double G if I had to base the ball and not only draw. I mean, you could just free dice the blodger with the. Well, you can't blitz with the tree, can you? No, nah, that's, no. that's that's too much. Got overexcited. Oh, that's where I was putting the tree. Yeah, but you can, what you can do now is you can blitz this guy, and then you can base the that guy with a tree, can't you? So it's all about a GFI. Yeah, but is it worth? Well, it's a pretty good player to blitz. I guess the tree GFI side. So. Where are all, all of Soul's players? He's got. Yeah, oh, well, he's got he's got a stun in the tackle. Oh, how has he ended up in this shape? I don't really don't know. <laughs> this is the sixth best table topper in the world. <laughs> Struggling to see how he's ended up in this conundrum. 
You would have thought he'd played against Wood Elves this weekend. <laughs> oh, he did play against Wood Elves this weekend, didn't he? <laughs> he could do me. <laughs> you would have thought you would have had a clue. <laughs> <laughs> so, engagement question for chat. <laughs> oh, there's the GFI. Uh, it was the GFI bait. Has, uh, has anyone got any idea how we've ended up in this situation on turn four. <laughs> and done it I know you I know you've just watched the game. <laughs> <laughs> so you actually know, but I'm still clueless. <laughs> it's wild, isn't it? Yeah. I think we just Oh I think we're ball carrier blitzing. Is that hang on, no, that's a catcher on this the stripper, catcher, isn't it? Yeah. So I I dodged the gutter, I dodged the block gutter and blitz with that, and then we just run off up the side. I feel like this isn't. I I guess with the tree it's a lot better, but I don't even think this is bad. I don't think the tree makes any difference, right? Because we're yeah. still just dodging. Like this this blitzer ain't gonna block anybody. Yeah. So. Oh, are we gonna give it to a gutter? Oh, Where's he going? Be down this side. Oh my god. It's a full pow. That's a lino. Is it? That's a, no. That's a, that's not a lino. That's a catcher. Yeah. No, I'm a break. Just a stun. And this means he gets to block with the uh, line rat rather than dodge it out. But yeah, but it means that he's closer to the stripper as well. Yeah. Not that the stripper matters because he's got it on sure hands, but oh, maybe that's the logic there. Yeah. Can he screen all of this? Like, there's gonna be no. There's gonna be. It's going to be dice to roll. Yeah, there's going to be dice on the ball, is what I'm thinking. No matter which way he slices I mean, there this. There always is, because you... Oh my god, he's put it in range of the frenzy as well. Mm -hmm. Not really. Oh, it's a cheater fight, so there we go. I mean, when, when you've got this dude here, he's just going to jump in. <laughs> or, like, dodge in, if, the, if these two don't work. Got a full cage here, wasn't he? Yeah. <coughs> I think we're gonna see a ball sack attempt next time. Maybe might might try and just be a bit more conservative, right? And because they, they're the fact they're squashed on the sideline, there's you know like a vague chance of being able to shut them down. So I wonder if three will go for the trying to shut them down. Are you one day in this or what? Are you one day in that lino? Um, and then following? Yeah, maybe. No, he dodges. Yeah. Re rolls. Yeah, tagged. Oh, he went one square too far! Yeah. Why did you go one square too far? <laughs> he doesn't want the gutter to get blitzed. But <laughs> I'll be more worried about the ball. This guy can like double GFI. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI, GFI. Oh. He's gone for the four plus tackle dodge. That's gonna take the armor roll. Yeah, seven. Tech in the gutter. I mean I I I mean I, I, I hate Sol's drive here, right? He disconnected we... the tackler. And the rat auger, and then one's been killed, one's been marked out of the game, and he's just trying to dacker with, you know, da without two players. Really weird, weird player from Sol. Uh, and he's, he's, unlucky, but. <laughs> he's protected the skillless gutter runner and not the strip wrestle one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, uh, <clears throat> the good news is the tree uh, fell over. Yeah. And the good news for Sol is that he didn't, he, you know, he, he looked at where the dancer was and didn't just get his stripper surfing all reasons, so you know, he's be better than yeah. me. <laughs> Hello, Coach Morg. Hello. Can he chain push the dancer into the cage? Uh, no, he can knock a corner down with the dancer and then just maybe two dice. Well, I, no, I think he... There's too many players. Need a, yeah, I need a lot of players, right? These two there. Yeah. And then this one there, and then this one here. So then that like would the have got there. But then you still need to cancel this, and then hit the ball with a wrestler. But yeah, could have more or less done it, yeah. 
The only issue is is Soul like I mean Soul's gutter runners are in range on a three plus handoff and two GFIs, but the ball's not in range, so and he doesn't want to score yet anyway, so you kinda of gotta turn just to reset. Yeah, I think I think just uh like try and box him in is the is the play here for the uh for the elves. Make him roll dice as well. Mm. Yeah, just try I and think, box him in and control him. I think Tree's gonna blitz the gutter runner that Soul tried to protect. Yeah. Just blitz that and then base the ball. No not base the ball. Not base the ball, but can um can get in front a bit, right? This one coming around. This one coming around. Definitely want to move these two before making a blockless block. Maybe don't even make the blockless block. Maybe just dodge with them as well, right? A blockless block. <laughs> it probably is best to make a blockless block, to be honest, because that could have killed that guy. But there you go. No. Oh, and now we're thinking about the. Oh! One Oh, we're thinking about the one turn re-roll, so doesn't re-roll it for the one turn, loses a player, dead, dead, dead. Excellent play by Soul. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. Yep, now I get to move his cage down here. And yeah, and the stripper. And get the tackler back up. Yeah. This is a funny old game, Jim. Yeah, I think, I think Tree had to get stuff like, you know, here. Yeah. Here. To stop this because obviously now Sol's got to get back more central because of the, the frenzy coming into play. It's annoying she got the both down on the gutter runner. She obviously wanted to pow and to base the ball. Oh, yeah, I like this. I like this. Get the tackler in. Where's he going though? Like, what are we doing with the ball? Are we over there somewhere. Oh, yeah, the ball carrier is not as fast as the. Oh my oh god! My another god. Death. <laughs> Is this? You don't want to appo with death, though, do you? Like, no, no. Do you know what, Jim? Dead, dead, dead. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, because the rattle grows well. <laughs> dead, dead, dead. <laughs> One, two, three, four, oh, five, nice. six, seven. So GFI, right? Why though? Like, One, what's two, the three. GFI? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So you get in a tight cage. You don't want a loose cage because it's easy for the dancer to get you. She's only got. Oh, she's got three. Gu he's got. Sorry, he's got three gutter runners. So you, yeah. you're. Oh, okay, I see. I see the cage now. Yeah. One, One two, two, three. three four, you know, that's a dodge. That's a dodge. Yeah, no, I'm just seeing if he can get there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, yeah. So it's just it's just one GFI with the uh, with the ball. No, oh, he's not even doing that. Okay. Oh, and then using that as the oh uh, yeah okay that, that works, isn't it? Clever soul. Clever soul. Clever soul. Wait, he didn't have to do a GFI anyway. No, he did the GFI. <laughs> God, he's just there instead of one back. So really. He did do the GFI, I just didn't see it. The bad thing gonna, is this he, one getting he, blitzed. I might have put this blocker out first. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the blocker was there getting hit in the strip. Less he's going to he's gonna put the other gutter next to it. He's going to leave the back corner open. Yeah, and also, like, yeah, th this, th this gutter can get to there. So... Is he going there, or is he going to yeah, go and yeah, screen? This one kind of got here. You're gonna make like the jump hard, like you're gonna make the leap hard for the the dancers, right? So is he standing up and one D in a dancer or one D? Which one do you one D? The frenzy? Uh, probably stand up and then dodge out this guy. Oh, and two D, yeah. So he's not getting Wait, smashed by he... mighty. No, it's not. He's not gonna get you a two D, but it would stop him getting I smashed tried by to the dodge. Three. Okay, well I think it was better to just stop this one getting smashed by the tree. 
Hello, Christopher B. Spike Ball is incredible, and you're weird for thinking that's bad. <laughs> he made it, didn't he? He cooked it today, didn't he? Yeah. Well, he he, he cooked bolognese, but not spaghetti. Oh, he cooked it with uh, tagliatelle, wasn't it? Mm. Is it called tagliatelle? No, what's it? What's the fat spaghetti called? I don't know. There's lots of fat spaghettis. No, you know, like the flat, long, wormy spaghetti. <laughs> Oh, it is tagliatelle. Yeah, I thought so, yeah. Oh, I thought you said fat, not flat. Yeah, I said the fat. Oh, oh no. no, I said flat, yeah. The yeah. fat, flat, <laughs> <laughs> long spaghetti. <laughs> well, it's not long, is it? It's just the same length. <laughs> no, oh, my God. She's failed so many geofires. It's unbelievable, Jeff. And now she's only got one reroll for the uh, one-turner. Yeah. And what was that for? Oh, it's a chain. There's no other chain there, though. No. If she went directly ahead and then filled the square, she could yeah, have chained wait. him onto the side. Was that yeah. misclick? Was the idea was to hit here? Was that just yeah, a misclick? Yeah, she, she, she could have chained the dancer onto the stripper. Yeah, this was a misclick, right? Like, this was meant to yeah. push to there. And then this one was going to come in here and then push into there, then hit that, and then hit the No, board. no, no. Yeah, yeah the dancer... This is fine as long as the dancer goes directly behind the rat, and then you fill the square on the right. You oh take yes, the hit, yeah, yeah, yeah. Either and way, then, and then way it, fine, and then it yeah. chains it onto the rat, yeah, and then you punch fine. that. Yeah. If you get the pow, yeah. you can get a two D. Um, yeah. Either way was fine, but the thing was like could have also just pushed here for the first hit, right? The first hit could have pushed this. Guy, yeah, 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 yeah. And then the dancer, hit. but yeah. So either way, it was a fuck up. <laughs> Yeah, it was a fuck the up only somehow. square that didn't work. Yeah, yeah, basically. <laughs> uh, pulled a seaball. <laughs> oh, she I love found the seaball square. <laughs> the seaball square, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, no oh my Double god, skulls. Google skulls on a dancer as well. And now you're thinking about the one turner. Just eats it. Not dead. Oh. What? The no, game's dead, bugged dead, him. Dead. Didn't die. Didn't die. Oh, now the play that Tree has to do has to try and get this line rat double dodge to foul the dance. <laughs> I think we're just smashing out with tackle and running to the corner, aren't yeah, we? Yeah, yeah. The tackle can punch this line also. Actually, We've one, got... two, three, four, and that gets you the foul as well. He might want, oh. honestly. He might want to cage here just so he can get more assist on the foul and the dancer. And she didn't take the tree D with the tree. No. Before that, I mean, shouldn't have right. The tree, the tree is a one in twenty-seven fail with Lona, and this is a one in thirty-six right. with team reroll. So it was correct to do this hit first. Just unlucky. Oh, dice it's again. Frenzy. Yeah, true. That makes it slightly more than one in thirty-six to fail. Yeah, because it's into a one D as well. Uh, oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. No. Yeah. Should have. Uh, Should have definitely. Um, <laughs> Definitely 3D. Done this one first, yeah, 3D. 3D with a tree. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Oh, he is getting away from the dancers. Oh, he's actually protecting the tackle as well. He's, he's evolving, Jimmy. He's evolving. <laughs> what a pussy. Run, running away from the war dancer. Yeah. <laughs> Just take well, this, it I like, Honestly, I, I, I mean, this is fine for next turn, but I don't know how he's going to... Stall out the next one. Yeah, exactly. He's got nothing in between. So it might be an early score. Yeah, which is obviously disastrous. It is against Woody's. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's amazing that he's managed to get. Like, it looks so bad on turn three. It, did, it looked, yeah. and then Tree just failed multiple GFIs, killed half her team, and. <laughs> Was it the GFI killed the wrestler, right? And then the tackler killed the dodger. Yeah. Oh my god, he just hates that strip ball wrestle rat, <laughs> doesn't he? He just yeah. absolutely hates it. Oh my god, 1D first. Rescues him from a tree hit. Bosh. Why does he hate the wrestle rat? Oh my god, oh my gets a god. Cast. Is that an apo? That's horrendous. Seriously hurt? No uh, apo for it, me. It's because um, it's a, um, like you say, an actual injury. Yeah. Oh. Reroll this, Sol. Reroll, reroll. Ah, oh, he did. He did reroll it he and did, failed. He did reroll it. Yeah. So right, right decision, wrong dice. 
This is horrendous for Tree. This is a bit of a dicing. I don't know. I'm so confused because she killed the Rogue. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The Rogue did also die instantly and then got uh, two kills really quickly. I guess it, you are hitting Woodies. Does get the power. Mm. This is going to be a dead rat in it. It's got to be. You'd hope so. Oh, dice. Was a, snakes the armor. And you know now it's Tree. If you if you foul that guy, you know he's just going to get set like double one. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, the off off we are fouling. Yeah, oh. and a send off here puts you down on what, seven players yeah, for the rest of the this game? This is a very risky foul. Gets the KO. KO. Oh, it's not double fours. Wow. And there's a 50% chance, well, 75% chance that it comes back anyway. Yeah. Obviously, you have so to what? tackle the dancer here, you have to give up a surf, but you have to stall it. There's no, there's no option. Is there not? No. No, you, you can't score out and in two turns. You just lose then, don't you? Yeah, so you just move the rookie gutter in for the assist, blitz it with tackle, move back, and then stay in the same cage, really? Yeah, yeah. It's, you can maybe double GFI that one, two, three. Yeah, this one can four. run around. Oh, you don't, even need to, you don't even need to double GFI, you can just complete that screen there. Like, left. Yeah, there, there, there. No! What? He did double GFI. He opened with a double GFI. Why did he do that? I guess to make sure it's there so he knows for the rest of the turn. And if it failed, he was still in like a full cage, wasn't he? Oh. He's got to be smashing that frenzy with tackle, no? I mean, I would. <laughs> I sure would. The problem is, like, I guess if you want a nine and stuff, isn't it? No, he's not. He's oh, being it. So what? what he's just venger bussing. He is just venger busing. Which is pretty decent, right? Because now the only place to hit is from here, and then you can't cancel that easily as three. So this is very safe. Very safe cage. Ah, uh, see it. Does he not just dodge in on a 5 plus? I mean, the thing is, if you dodge in the 5 plus here, it's uphill because you can't cancel this. So you've got to you've got to jump in. You got four. You've got to, you, you, and then here it's an uphill as well. So you've got to like leap in with one and then and then dodge in with the other, or like leap in with both of them. Or yeah, probably leap in with both, right? Or dodge in with both, so you keep your rear for one turn. Or... Here we go. Oh my god, failed the jump. Not dead. Alright. Gotta so, tackle the dancer first. Smash the dancer with tackle. This has been a really strange game. Yeah, it looked so bad for Sol at the start, then it just can't. It looks so down bad, and now it, now it just looks incredible for Sol. I mean, obviously, no Rogar, <clears throat> and it means that there's, just there's no. Teeth. Well, yeah, but there's no. <laughs> Saka. Like if the strip Saka comes back, like this is yeah, it's seventy five percent to come back, isn't it? So Yeah. Chances then... are it's back. I'll just what just hits the catcher. I can't move all that. Can't I really that. hate that. I would million percent hit the dancer. One million oh. percent. And so that's the, well, all three of his kills come back, so he's still got the uh, he's still got the, he's got the sacker back. So he should swap the sacker for the bench, right? Yes. Yep. Bit worse against a timeout, but a bit better against uh, a vicious ref. So it's not necessarily better to to bench it, but you know, I think most people would. Oh, because the timeout. Yeah, yeah. But the risk of the risk of the uh, other one is horrendous, isn't it? Like the uh, officious ref. Yeah, the officious ref is. Uh, oof. Oof. Oh, 
at me. Guy's benching the thrower. Interesting. I wonder if he's going to bench the thrower in defense as well. Uh, well, he's got three rerolls without it, isn't he? I mean, the one turn, like he, he does that for the one turner, but the one turner is a lot less likely without the roger. Oh, is it? Uh, yeah, I guess it is. It's yeah, a lot it less likely without sidestep. Is the problem? If you have sidestep, it's so good, isn't it? Well, you got the. I mean, it depends whether Tree scores this or not, right? Yeah. Without the Roger, um, then you can try the Push Denial, but I mean, even then the Push Denial isn't great, right? And you've got to set up correctly and... Ah, uh, she's doing the Frenzy. Oh, she hasn't got a sidestep, though, so... Yeah, this is low, oh, low, this is low chance with movement 8. So she's going to Frenzy. Why has he put the Tackle there? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, he hates his Tackle there. I'm in the row back, <laughs> mad man. I guess it's because the dodge has to go. Like he's anticipating that she was going to push the front and then dodge through the tackle, but yeah. she's just going to chain the tackle, right? I don't know. Actually, I don't know how she's doing this. This seems weird. Yeah, I would have just done it through the centre. If you're going to do anything with a with a frenzy, then you can start on the LOS, right, and then push and then push again into the hole. That's good because then you can push completely free and not make any dodges at all. But it like you know it takes more dice. Yeah. And it Yeah, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Yeah. But uh, I don't know what this is. This looks like playing for a timeout. <laughs> I'm bamboozled. <clears throat> no, this is maybe she's frenzying into the tree and not standing firm. Oh, quick snap! Well, it works amazing with a quick snap. <laughs> Whatever oh it God. is. Yeah. She's got no thrower though, has she? So it's still not. Right, if she can't hand off. I guess the bounce in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, she's gonna have to throw a pass in the rain. Mm. Hang on, one. If it bounces left, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, one, two, she's gonna have to throw a pass. One, whatever two, she three, does. four, five, six, seven, eight. GFI, GFI, hand off. So. If it scatters here, right. can do a handoff. Okay. Off. It has to go for that square to do handoff, yeah. otherwise it's going pass, right? Yeah, literally one square is. <laughs> otherwise, yeah, it's going to have to be like a handoff to somebody else and then a pass because it catches up worse at throwing, I think. Well, she, needs, off, she, needs, she needs another two pushes as well, right? Yeah, uh, yes, yeah. But obviously, like, way easier, like, incredibly easier now with this. The quick snap is oh, if the ball bounces correctly, if the ball doesn't bounce correctly, you know, it's I mean, it's still unbelievable. Like the quick snap is just unbelievable. This, I didn't even know how this was going to work, but now it's uh, easy. <laughs> no, so it's a pass, yeah. which makes it a lot more difficult. Because it's what they got four plus pass in the catchers. Yeah, yeah, everyone does. And then it's minus one in the rain, so no, it's like a five to the catch is the. Uh, oh, one. okay. Gets the push. Dodge the dancer. Double GFI and pass it now. Uh, the, just problem the, is, the problem is, um, I guess you can like hand it off to the dancer. That's a three plus. It might be best just to just to do the pass now, even though you're giving an the... intercept chance. Probably should have done it before. Should have done it before she did the blitz. You're getting minus. You're getting minus two to the pass now, aren't you? 
because the tackle zone in the rain. Yeah, but so I mean, two to catch. but the problem so is that it's it like adds a three plus if you hand it off to the which, which you already ha you've already moved in. So, so maybe now it's a five maybe. plus pass, which is terrible. Oh my goodness! Reroll it, reroll. But no reroll for the pickup. <laughs> no, all the ha all the pass, which is going to be a five plus pass now. Three plus pick up in it. Yeah. Oh, I guess the dancer could pick it up and hand it off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. The, so the dancer picks it up, hands it off to the catcher, and then the catcher does a short pass. Okay, I'm an idiot. But I'm the short idiot. pass is still a four plus, right? Yeah. Yeah. No. Okay. So source tree. <laughs> um, this was wrong. This was wrong. It was definitely the dancer picks it up, hands it off to the catcher. A million percent. That was the correct play. So you're adding a three. This was you're adding a you're adding a one in thirty six three plus three plus. I mean, I don't know what tree's doing instead. Is this a pass? Is this a pass activation? Yeah, it is a pass action. It's like going to be a five yeah. plus pass or something, or maybe even a but six surely plus the pass. five plus. Surely the five plus is better than a one in like a two plus with reroll three plus three plus then a four plus. I don't. I think I still think the five plus is better, Jim. No, it's definitely not. It was it was a two plus with reroll, right? And then a three plus with reroll, and then a four plus pass. Which Which doesn't have a reroll. Yeah, yeah, there's no reroll. It's got on. dodge and the catchers have got catch. Hang on. <laughs> it was way it going better. That? Oh, it's inaccurate. So yeah. you don't even try and interfere this, no? Um, no, 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 no. There's no need to, is there? But he does. Oh, it, it has the it gas. Yeah, it was it was an, there was an intercept chance. As well, it was way better, way better. Hang on, but if you interfere there, if you interfere there and she catches it on the dancer, can she then hand off with a dancer? Um, yes. Yeah. So surely he shouldn't have interfered with that. Maybe he not. Yeah. But then the problem is, is if you don't interfere with it and it bounces and yeah. then catches it. <laughs> yeah. So, so I guess the interfere is fine. Yeah. Yeah, that was, that, was, that was a mistake there, but I mean... The soul, uh, forget his lino, uh, his leader. I think, he he might, deliberately... I think he'll just bench it for the one turn. You think? Yeah, it's only like, it's just worse than a lineman, right? Like, during the drive, it's just worse than a lineman because he's a lineman that you have to protect. He hasn't got anything above a lineman. He's just literally a lineman that you don't want to hit. Instead of a lineman that you will gleefully get hit instead of a gut runner. So yeah, I think he'll I think he'll keep it benched for the one turn. Oh. That was a surprising mistake. Um, at least at least I got there in the end. <laughs> But uh, yeah, that was the the dancer was was like a lot better, like actually tons better. Really? It. Yeah, yeah. I didn't see it. I didn't see it for ages, but it was way better. Two plus three plus three plus to make the pass a four plus instead of a five plus. Two pl two plus with reroll, and three plus yeah. with reroll. And then the three plus, plus another reroll. Oh, with well, the catch. catch. Yeah. Oh, is catches it a catcher? Catch. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Catch. Yeah, there was a naked three plus. So for he's got to. He's got to pick up the ball anyway, Timmy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like whether right. he's a catcher right. or he's a dancer, he's still got to pick the ball up. So it was. Okay. It was adding a two plus with reroll and a three plus with reroll to a four plus, and that's way better than a five plus. Okay. They're talking about it in trees. <laughs> on trees. JD Whitey has called it on trees. Would it have been better to use the war dancer? Yes, yes it would have been. A lot better. Plus also it's saving the two plus of the of the intercept, right? Or the interference. But couldn't the tackle guy interfere with it anyway? No, because he'd be knocked over at that point. Oh, of course he had, uh, yeah. So it was saving the interference as well, so it was way it was way better. JD Whitey has said, oh, totally sorry. wasn't trying to suggest you were totally wrong. <laughs> well, <laughs> she was. <laughs> That's okay, isn't it? That's okay. Like, it's okay. Wow. People, if, if it's wrong, it's wrong. Like, do you know what I mean? It, it just is what it is. There's yeah, no... but it's, it's like when you're, when you're playing a game like this, it's the last thing you want to hit. <laughs> like, 
at that precise moment in time. Like, yeah, yeah true, maybe fair, fair. maybe have a conversation about it like an hour after the game or whatever. But right yeah, now, it's like, just let me play Blood Bowl and shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like when you when you give the ball to a zombie, like. Cause, uh, <laughs> I mean, that was totally wrong. Sorry, Dimmy, it was. Yeah, yeah. Like, I've got seven people popping up going, what the hell are you doing? Like, yeah. yeah, cheers, guys. Uh, thanks. Thanks for the moral support. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, this is going to be pretty tough, isn't it? Eight players, eight players versus 11. Honestly, I, th I think there's some equity in not streaming when you play these games. Like, oh, there is. I mean, I always... I say that, team. but I've done horrendous things in every <gasps> game. Oh my god. What no. was that? It was a corner cut. Oh no. Oh, was it? No. It was it was a it was a patented misspell tree corner cut. <laughs> oh dear. Well luckily there's uh there's no real route to the ball. I mean they got runners, Jim, like I'm sure Stole can find the free two <laughs> to stack the fucking ball. I, mean, I don't even twos, need you need it. Twos, do you? Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah. So you're in, now you're endorsed in the corner cut. Oh, how convenient. Well, when it's the only way you can get there, Dimmy. I'm, 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 I'm trolling you, mate. <laughs> when you don't have to make them, don't make them. There you go. Like, like that's the rules. And he still might not go for it because he's just run this tackler right back. What the hell? No, I think the tackler's because he is going for it. Like, I know that sounds ridiculous, but I think that's his fail save. Because he's mm. going to cut the corner with that cut runner. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Rush, rush. So he, he needs a dodge with the skillless gutter. Then he needs the dodge, rush, rush with the stripper. And he can one... Oh, no, it's 2D the ball. I think with, what he uh, might do is, is do this block. And if he pows, 3, 2 with the, with the stripper. Oh, uh, okay. Through here. But, I mean... Yeah. Three re-rolls. Five, six, seven, eight. Here comes the assist. And then he can three, two with it through with this one as well. Yeah, um, no, he's got to pick it up on the bludger afterwards, isn't he? Oh, yeah, well, with, the, with the bludger, you know, it's even better. Oh, he's got yeah, all the way Get better direction. Strippy, strippy. Gets the plim plom push. The plim plom strip. Mm. Oh, oh my, god. my god, you <laughs> scumbag soul. You absolute scumbag. <laughs> Can you get the blodge around there? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah. You can, yeah. God, I hope this is how my rats go next, like tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Just completely screwed. I mean, to be fair, Trees failed a dodge and has the player, failed a GFI, killed a player. Oh, pick it up, soul, you yeah. madman. Yeah, these, the, the, I mean, it. the dancer was the most unlucky, double one into death, <laughs> into death essentially. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it doesn't even pick up the ball. You no. would have picked up the ball. I don't like leaving the ball because now you just scatter it and then yeah give it to the dancer and then see you later. But now, it, now at least it's getting scattered from here around your players. Whereas if he picks it up, then uh, that guy just gets hit with a stripper and then it's less tackle zones. So this is a little bit more risky, I would say. I, I don't, I don't hate not picking it up. Like normally, it's terrible not picking up against Elf, of course. Of course, it's terrible. But um. It was like a four plus, right? Which could have gone somewhere else, and would have got no, stripped instantly push. anyway. I guess he can catch it. Oh. oh, that's good for tree. Yep. That's even better. Nash made a dodge. A four plus pickup though. No Easy. Elf canal. Probably should have picked up. But hasn't, it wouldn't have mattered. Hasn't, right? hand it off. If it hasn't put the oh. hand off thing. Well, there's maybe, no way to go. Maybe <laughs> Where was that to go? Yeah, just instantly getting stripped again. Yeah. This is all well and good, but no fucking players left. All instant stripped. 
I wish Charles Tackler was somewhere. <laughs> no, yeah, that was wild. I, I thought, what's he doing? His defensive daiquiri? That was so weird. He's gonna, he's gonna forget it's there, isn't he? A hundred percent. He's gonna forget it's there. He's gonna, like, it's like it's so weird that like you know where they like start your player in the end zone. It's it's so weird that someone's actually started with a player out of the end zone and then ran it into the end zone and then forgotten about it. Like that's that's new levels of just. Ooh, that's where I would have pushed the. That's where I would have pushed the catcher. Yeah, this is this is questionable. Oh, I really hate that. I would have definitely pushed the catcher there. Uh, this is questionable. Yeah, Unless he's going know. down. No, he's going there. Oh my god, you look at that. Absolute genius. <laughs> Absolute genius play from Sol. Sol's a genius, isn't he? This guy is legendary. He knew where the ball was going to get stripped to <laughs> and then gave himself the double bounce. What a hero. I'll just at everyone then, Steve. Sorry. I'll just at everyone in future. Um, until I until I sort out the roles and do all that. He hasn't picked it up again. What's he doing? Oh, <laughs> please pick up the ball, Sol. <laughs> For the love of God. Just, it might be the bludger. That might be the bludger this time. Surely. Yeah. Surely one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's nine. Yeah, but now he has to probably geofry unless the, he wants to get surfed. And the problem is. Uh, Failing it right, failing the pick up, and it just going in the crowd and stuff is is it? I'm disaster. going straight to that dancer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like this is the problem. This one in nine is massive now, and it goes into the crowd, and it goes straight to the dancer. Oh. <laughs> well, good job he's got this tackler. But the thing is, that tackler isn't even any good because he just blitz this guy and then base the tackler anyway. So it didn't even do anything there anyway. Oh my god. That's unbelievable, isn't it? I mean, at least you called it perfectly, Dimmy. Let's <laughs> go straight to the dancer. Yep. Just up in here, isn't it? Blitz this. Oh my god. Outrageous. Now it's like a full cage as well with the tree. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's not even a potato. It's just literally, it's just a literal full cage. Catch it and dodge out to complete it. This is how you pick it up, Sol. <laughs> Why didn't you just pick it up? <laughs> yeah, it does need a 3 2. But then it's a full cage. Looking like a draw. It is a little bit, yeah. That was crazy. Because it wasn't too easy. The crazy thing was, it wasn't that easy to scatter it. So that was a weird pick up. It was, right? yeah, the square and it, the push direction and mm. stuff. Eight times out of nine, obviously, he's, he's pretty happy to have done that. But um, the failure state was just so bad of it going into the crowd and then going straight to the dancer, which. <laughs> While it was very unlucky to happen that way, like about one in eight chance, it still happened and uh, yeah, pretty bad. Oh, it's three in eight, isn't it? Let's go. But then there's the way, which way it goes in, right? If it goes oh, back in this okay, way, yeah. it's not so bad. If it goes back in this way, it's directly the dancer. This way, it's basically directly the dancer. So I guess two of the three is more like a one in four scatter. Well, the good news for Sol is the dancer's not in range. So. Yeah, he's got another turn at least. He's got one more bite of the cherry, yeah. That, see, this is now where you should be deploying the safety and putting the stripper back, right? Yes, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's, the stripper can go all the way back. Probably oh, first. he's blitzed him before he's moved him. Oh, God. So that is shit. <laughs> no oh. offence. But that's definitely wrong. You definitely want this move done first, at least. Yeah. And probably all of the moves done. Oh boy, he's an okay. Wow. Okay. Why is it based in uh... like this line? Uh... Done that. This line right yeah. done that job better as well because it's strength three. 
Well, you just stun, stun the wrestle stripper with a full power, and then <laughs> yeah, and then the tackler's tied up. So that seems really weird. Any the oh, I don't know. Oh, Around the back man. and take that line. Yeah, yeah. okay, that, that's okay actually. Yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. Then. But I really would have liked the stripper just like here too. The fact is, you say he can't score this turn. The dancer. This guy's down, yep. So, three hit, free the wrestle. And then what? Blitz the back line, right? I don't know. It's, it's going to be terrible, whatever you do here. Um, I mean, yeah, it's not great, is it? She's got no catches there. Oh, that's a catcher behind her. The blitz. Sure, we're going backwards. Mm. I guess it's early yet anyway, isn't it? I suppose. Yeah. Doesn't get the pow. That's okay, though, because you can just cage around the tree, can't you? With like twos out and stuff. And two Ds. Yeah, this is pretty good. Yeah, power there. And then the wrestler or the catch the wrestler or the catcher can come around. Make it three dice for the tree, yeah. Yeah. And uh, and finish the cage. Now scoring for it. Mm. Two scoring for it. <coughs> we going in for the strip here. Maybe Sol likes a strip and it is a four plus. It is a four plus in, isn't it? And you can like have lots of players based up and stuff so that even if it fails it's basically like a free roll. So yeah, I think you'll kinda of base everybody. It's like like honestly if anyone's been following a long Super League and watched Soul play before, he does not move this quickly. He's made his <laughs> mind up. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Funny enough, he says he always plays quite fast on tabletop, but um, not not on Blood Bowl Three. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It seems like he's made his mind up, and then he slows down all of a sudden. I think it's just like sudden. the details, right? The details. Of it. So he's tagged both. Oh, we're coming in around the back corner, yeah. right? Yeah, so, yeah, 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 yeah. And then you got the bludger for recovery. So you want to tag that back? You got to put the gutter runner on. Oh, unless no, the, no, you, you keep don't need to tag. Yeah, you don't need to tag anything because it's just double. Anyway. So yeah. So you keep all. But I mean, like, it's, it's nice to tag him. So he has to dodge if you fail the dodge. Yeah, but then it's another gutter that could have scored, right? I think I think you've got to just do the dodge in. Thanks the dodge. Gets the, the, the strip. Push. Wonder if she picks the pal. <laughs> she doesn't. <laughs> Already better than, better than Jimmy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Already better than Jimmy. <laughs> and now you just don't follow, and you've tagged you've tagged them like so. This is like better success state, isn't it? This is the thing. This is like which way you pushing? You got to push left, right? Yeah. Sure, yeah. Oh, it does follow. Okay. And rightly play. Yeah, it looks good now, now that it gets the scatter from there. Oh my god, caught it. <laughs> Hang on, did he pop dodge? It's, it's three out, isn't it? It's a three, yeah, three. It's a three, three. Oh, hang on, you out. can't hand off because of the blitz. Uh... No. But you could three, three, two out. Oh my goodness. He hasn't popped dodge yet, has he? No, oh my god, he's got away as well. <laughs> oh my rat. Everybody. Rat. <laughs> oh my rat. <laughs> Get ratted. I mean, he's getting sacked next turn. Yeah. Is he just eye caging? Oh, no. He's gonna do some futile screen. Yeah, you've got you've got to attempt the futile screen. Yeah. Just any extra roll you can make the dancer make, isn't it? Which is like this is what one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Do you have had you? That's quite a lot of rolls. Or like hit with a tree first, and then one, two, three, four. 
five, six, seven. Yeah, so it, it actually is best to do this. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, sorry. Oh my god, cars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh no, so do I have to cut the corner? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. Yeah, you've got to cut the corner, so two dodges with dodge. And then who's recovering? Yeah, this that catcher. The catchers, yeah, there's, this ca there's a lino here, and a catcher here, and a catcher here. And the rest of the way, I mean, you've just got to do the hit. Right, that's it. Do the hit first, worry about everything else later. I guess what you'd like is to get the wrestler out to here so that you can hit to a better square, right? So yeah, that's what she does. Because the catch is faster to recover afterwards. So dodging out the wrestler adds a bit of risk, but it gives you the punch from here. And the better yeah. push out to there. Gets the power. Cool power. No armor break though. And it's in attack zone. And it's in a bad square as well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Like GFI handoff. What, next to the stripper? Yeah, like bring someone in next to the stripper. Okay, yeah, okay. Have the stripper there and then hand off the stripper. So this is like, it's a four plus pickup, isn't it? She's got yeah. three rerolls. She's still got three rerolls, wow. I don't know if he's trying to get like a catcher there to hand it off to, but then just get they get stripped instantly. This way you can foul the stripper as well, right? You can you can go oh, one, with two, the ball three, carrier. four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, hand off. And then oh, the no lineman foul, comes yeah. in and fouls the stripper. And then you keep the tackler occupied. So is it is three two out for this Yeah. Oh no, it's just two. Oh okay. Or oh, could have jumped oh, down man. maybe. Does no all pass. The hands, yeah, no handle. So, do we just foul? I think we've got to foul. I think you've got to foul the stri stripper. Yeah, but if you foul, then you're just leaving. I mean, if you don't foul, you're just going to get sacked, guaranteed. Like, th this is the problem, right? If you don't foul, you're auto sacked. So, no, she's just going to screen the front by the looks of it. That's a dodge off tackle as well, three off tackle. Mm. This has been a mad game. This is like so entertaining. Yeah, it's been wild. Indeed, up first, either, or war time. The second half has definitely been more entertaining than the first half. Yes, but yeah, yeah. Yeah, the first half was we, weird. It looked like it was going to be entertaining and then just became weird instead. <laughs> Everyone just kept dying, Jim. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone's dead. Okay, so the problem with this is now that you've freed the tackler, you have to go here to stop the tackler hitting you. Yeah, which no, still leaves the back, back, which is still super easy to pop around the back. Like, it's still automatic around the back, right? Line right in there, gutter there, two dice for strip. So you're still yeah, getting a strip just the same. But yeah, the strip, the strip, the, there's less like decent places to strip it to though, right? Because you want to strip it away from the dancer. Yes, but... yeah, you're going to have to put it to there. And you can't get in there because of the tree. Yeah. You here, so it is better. It is, it is, it is, it is good. But, um... I don't know if it's that good to have not fouled the stripper. <laughs> I mean, fouling the stripper is only good if you, if you like, you know, KO the stripper, really. Uh, that lineman would have been here for me. So I don't know why that line... Now it's going to be a gutter? I don't like this from Sol. Unless he's not going to go for the strip. Because I guess he gets a gutter and a surf, doesn't it? Well, you can't afford to surf the gutter. Maybe we're going for a reset turn and uh, just going for a tackle blitz. Like maybe he thinks it's a bit tricky with all the, you know, the tree there and everything. Maybe he thinks the recovery is too hard, so he's just going to tackle blitz. Nope, he's just going to wander. I was, of course, completely wrong. 
as if a Skaven coach would think of being sensible. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Well, what are you and he's pushed the next to the dancer as well. Mm. Well, well, that's not a good pickup. No. He's got to tag the dancer with a fucking ship and arrow. Yeah. Foolish Jim thinking that we'd see a sensible turn from a Skaven coach. It was just, how can I roll all of the dice? <laughs> oh, Magnus. Five plus pick up five, mate. No? No, no. I've got to tag that line, I don't. Or maybe not. Maybe move this guy in, like here. Yeah, that's what I thought, yeah. Probably is if the two plus to get served. Move this guy in there, and then at least becomes a little bit harder to surf him. And then, like, the tackle could come in there. Oh, yeah, you can just. He's gonna tag the tree. Mm. Tag your tree. Tag your tree, huh? Yeah. Tag your tree out, that's it. <laughs> it's nearly. nearly. Past it. This is, I mean, this isn't easy, is it? But it's it's easy in that you're just blitzing with a dancer and picking it up. But not blitzing. Not, apparently not blitzing with a dancer and picking it up on the string three. I'd have definitely rather had it on the dancer. I think what we're going to see here, Jim... Is that wrestler dodge out and blitz the guy next to the dodger, and then we're going to pick it up on a catcher, run around, hand it off to the dodger, and we're just going to run over to the left out of range of everyone, and yeah. Sol's not going to see the pull again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe, maybe Sol should have had stuff. His tackle should maybe stayed a bit central. Oh, oh play out the dodge. I mean, have to be very well. Oh, blitzing the guy. Oh. So, are we doing a four plus handoff? Seems wild, but possible. Uh, I thought that wrestler was going to run all the way around. Oh, oh my god! Oh no, just punching. I like your idea more, do me. Yeah, just, just run, run all the way over there. I guess you're scoring too early there as well, though. Yeah, true. We're doing the handoff. To the dodger, no, to the, this one. Is that the one square? Yeah. I was seeing if she pops dodge. I mean, it's just going to get 2D from the, instantly. Save from the tackle, though. But yeah, no block. Well, you can dodge that lino out and tag it, right? I think that's what we're going to see. We can get a screen, can we? Mm, more or less. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, that line rat that, that's lowest on the screen can still get there as well. Yeah. Three gutters can do it as well. Oh, sorry, two gutters. It only needs two gutters. So just two gutters could go. The problem the tree has now is no dancer to get the ball back after Sol gets it this turn, right? <laughs> like at least if you keep it on your on your stripper, at least if Sol gets the ball off you, you can just get it back each time. But yeah, out of range of the stripper, out of range of this gutter. But this gutter could still uh, face. Can the blitzer blocker reach, can he? Maybe just hit this guy oh. and then the blocker runs around. He needs to get something back. Mm hmm. <coughs> Mm -hmm. 
So Gorus is there and then block him. And then you've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Double Geophyte, a 2D at the block. You really want to hit it with block, right? Because of. Uh, is it, wait, is this Blitzer? The Blitzer could just hit. The Blitzer can just hit. Didn't even need this one. Oh, re last reroll gone. Gets a full pow. That's a big advantage to Sol now, just purely on, like, you know, no reroll. Well, okay, one reroll for three, but ball on the ground in the rain. Got it, can just go there. And the block got it, can come at the end to try and pick it up. This guy can come in for this punch. This one can come in for this punch. This gutter can go and protect, and this gutter can come and pick it up. Five minutes ago, Sol. Curry up. <laughs> move, move, move. Oh, I don't like this. Because I, I, I want him to pick it up. So I want more gutters back first. I'd have definitely gone gutter in, punch, gutter back, and then... I think Sol was anticipating the straight. hand off. Right onto that dodge line. Yeah. Which is fair. I mean, it's fair to an extent, but I want the ball and a bludger. I think, yeah. you know, I think that's also fair. <laughs> Is the dancer in range of that ball now? Not, not quite. Just, I mean, basically not, right? Mm. Oh my god, just rolls all the dice, double GFI. Fails the pickup. With me. This is so tense, oh my god. <laughs> it is intense. Very intense game. It's mad, mate. Like <laughs> trees picked up everything, and Sol's not picked up a yeah. thing. Man, the second yeah. half. Yeah, I mean, it would have been a lot more boring if Sol had just made the pick up and won. So yeah. at least like this has been uh, be made for a more entertaining half. The fact that you know he's got no five... reroll now either. So there's there's no one turn. Like he's just out the window. Right? Yeah, like all the elves, like not not they're not being many elves, and them struggling has been a lot more fun than uh, you know. <laughs> the the rats um, passing things and just winning easily. Uh, scoring for it. Mm. It is fucking intense. Oh wow! Here we go. Just dodge, pick up. Finally fails a pick up. And that could be it, couldn't it? Reroll well, goes Sol's in. Well, Sol's got, got to pick it up. Tree's got three scoring threats, all right? Yeah. So, can we just knock them all over? <clears throat> We've got the tackle hit there. Um, the dancer is still going to be in range even if we get the push. I can push him twice, right? can push him into there. Oh, and yeah. Then push him in and then push him back. Don't stand on the ball. Why are you not standing on the ball? 3D this one first, which is completely reasonable. Mm, it's not picked up on Bludge either. No, yeah, okay, I don't like not picking up on Bludge. But that, that hit first is fine. And then this hit and see if you power. In fact, you don't even need to power, right? You can just push this one to here. He's out of range, yeah. Yeah, and then you can come round, blitz the dancer into here. And then push push him away, and then dodge away, and then sort it. That's getting harder and harder to do by using activations up here. Oh, he's already blitzed. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Literally blitzed. Yeah, oh, yeah you idiot. So just push them out of the way. I'm an absolute memory. And now we've got to tag the dancer and go for the pickup, I guess. <laughs> I guess we're not tagging a dancer. Oh god. 
Oh god. You have to punch this dude, don't you really? Both down? Uh, I don't hate where it is, it's in two tackle zones. Like this is pretty difficult, isn't it? For the elves. Like I really don't hate this at all, but so Oh I didn't follow either. Okay. Now, now it's really good. Because this, this catches out range. The only one in range is the dancer. And then so the dancer can't hit it and get it at the same time. So that, now, now it's really, really safe, isn't it? Now you can dodge this guy out to stand in front of the dancer or whatever. Do you not bring the ball one square forward? No, I'm, I'm happy with it where it is. Okay. Be better further back because they've got to come through to hit you. Yeah, even further away. Yeah, 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 in the corner. Perfect. Now, now only the dancer. Now the dancer has to. Now the dancer can't beat you as well. Okay, that's that's absolutely perfect. Oh, that's GG. Well done, Saul. Well done, Saul. He knew that. <laughs> he knew that gutter runners. He counted squares. Now. Unbelievable. <laughs> yeah. Someone counting squares in BBSL. Who yeah. would have thought? It's outrageous, isn't it? Top tier square counter, Saul. That's why he's number six in the world on tabletop. <laughs> on tabletop. On tabletop. USA's MVP at Euro Bowl. Counting fucking squares. Unbelievable. I feel like he's cheating. It is a little bit cheating, isn't it? Counting squares, honestly. Yeah. Honestly, that's... Uh... It's basically cheating. I just like to uh, set up at random, and you know, if you surf my best players, you surf my best players. It is yeah, it is. I just set up as random, and whoever's closest <laughs> picks up the ball, right? Yeah, right? That's, exactly. that's the rules, no? It's the rules. Exactly, exactly. These these people are basically cheating. <laughs> They're counting squares and using appropriate players. <laughs> there you go. Congratulations, Sol, and commiserations, Tree. That leaves them both on two wins and two losses after four games. And uh, my game versus Andy is tomorrow. And of course, if I win, which is a massive if, then we will also be on two wins and two losses as well. So there you go. Um, very, very exciting how we, this group is hitting up. But whatever happens with that loss for Misspelled Tree, that means Dimmy G is guaranteed to be top of the table after four games. Congratulations. Yeah, but... I, I might not qualify. For it. <laughs> it's it's not guaranteed yet. It's not guaranteed yet. No, no, I, no. no it's not guaranteed. Um, because Andy if you could win. No, you need to win and yes. then beat me, and yes. then all three of us are on. And then Andy wins his last game, obviously. Yes, because you've got the head-to-head -head versus Tree and Soul, right? And Hero, yeah. And Hero, yeah. So, so what what needs to happen is Dave needs to lose to me, and then. And then he needs to beat three, and then he'll be. And on then three, you zero, need to two, beat me. And I need to beat yeah. you, and then then we all three will be on three zero two, yeah. But then both of you have got head to head over me, so I would lose, right? Yes, yes. Oh, okay. Yes, so yes. <laughs> I just need I need Andy to get a draw or better against you, and then I'm guaranteed qualification. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, Andy. <laughs> Thanks, Timmy, and uh... <laughs> <laughs> don't forget to like and subscribe <laughs> and stay fantastic. <laughs>